hello everyone. Yeah, I know. I said I was going to be making a lot of videos over my Christmas break, but I guess I lied. I've just been really enjoying having all this free time and spending all the time with my family and just, just relaxing from school because you know how stressful it can get. So, yes, it's 2016. Like, wow. Where did the time go? Like, I had a realization the night of New Year's and I was like, oh my god, I'm gonna be 20 this year. 20! Like, I'm not a teenager anymore. What? I don't, I don't even know how I feel about that. It's just, it's really weird. I know 20 is not like a huge party, all that kind of stuff. It's not that big of a milestone in your life, but I don't know. I feel like it really is going to be different for me because it's a realization saying like, oh wow, you should probably grow up a little bit more because you're not a teenager. Like, you're going to be almost an adult and you're going to be out of college soon, so might want to start acting a little bit more mature, but that probably won't happen. <laughs> this video is basically not a video directed towards anybody and all this kind of stuff. It's basically just a video from me. Something that I can look back on and see what kind of New Year's resolutions that I have. One of my biggest resolutions this year is to stay in touch with people more often. And I just, I really want to stay in touch with all the people that I know from my back home and at school. I just don't like burning bridges and like losing contact with people just because you never know, maybe one day you'll stumble across them in public and be like, oh hey, like I haven't talked to you in forever and all this kind of stuff and just, I don't know, I just really want to stay in contact with people more and not take people's friendships and everything for granted because I really do appreciate all the friends that I have and all the family that I have and just life is special, you know, like you just something might happen to that person you would never know about it because you haven't talked to them in so long so I'm trying to rebuild some friendships and just you know start talking to a lot of people again because you need people in your life because people do make you happy and who knows maybe something will happen like you just never know another resolution that I have is also to just try and stay happy more and stay positive because if you're happy and you're positive it makes for way better outcomes in everything that you do. Like, I'm going to try my best to stay positive no matter what happens at school or what happens with life and boys and whatever. Being happy obviously puts you in a better attitude and you're so much more, like, lively and you're more talkative and all that kind of stuff. Like, if you're more happy, again, like, your outcomes will be a lot better. And staying positive is something that I know I really need to try and do. I... Whenever things go wrong, I tend to look on the bad side of things, but I really need to stop that because having a negative attitude is bad, and you really need to try and stay positive, look at things on the brighter side, and be like, hey, this could have been a lot worse, and all this kind of stuff, and just, you, I just really want to try and stay positive to myself, that way I can live a longer and happier life, and just, I really, I really want to. Being more positive is just the way to be and not be a negative person. And obviously my typical New Year's resolution is try and lose weight and get healthy. Again, that's basically everybody's. I'm, but I seriously, I seriously need to try and follow that this time. And me, future me watching this, stop eating fast food and all that bad stuff. It's not good for you, it's bad for your health. You wanna live a long life, don't you? Yeah, you do, so stop it and just eat healthy. I think kind of another New Year's resolution for me this year is also just to branch out a little bit more. No matter that be like trying new hobbies, trying new sports, and talking to new people, and just stuff like that. But like branching out outside of your comfort zone and just trying to see like a variety of things that I might like because there might be something out there that I am super in love with that I haven't even tried yet. So I mean it only makes sense just to try it and spread your horizons really far and just try and branch out and get out of your comfort zone because that's I know it's fun to be in your comfort zone and that's like where you feel safe but what's life without a little risk and then probably my last one is to try and not turn down any opportunities that come my way that's it also kind of falls on the alliance of like 
branching out and stuff, but if you ever get an opportunity to do something, you should definitely take it because saying yes would be, it's just what you should do. And if you say yes, you might end up really liking what this opportunity has and you never know what it can, where it can take you. Like, you can maybe get a job out of it, a new friendship and stuff like that. Like, you should just try new things and take opportunities. It's kind of like saying like, oh yeah, you should, you shouldn't live life like on the edge, like not like that crazy, but you shouldn't feel, you shouldn't live life in fear. Like you should not live in fear because that would just be awful. And so I'm telling myself now that I really need to take more opportunities and branch out and all this kind of stuff. And if I don't stick to my resolutions, then I mean, I'm going to try my best to because I really need some structure in my life and just need to find out more about me. Like, I don't really know who I am personally, but I can, I can definitely find myself if I follow all my resolutions. And I know a lot of people don't stick to their resolutions, but you actually really should make ones that are probably like achievable because then if you achieve something you're gonna feel so much better about yourself and you're gonna be like oh wow look at that I stuck to a resolution like for once in my life but yeah I think that might have been it for my resolutions and stuff so I'm I'm really sorry that I didn't make a lot of videos over my Christmas break I I just got really into like the relaxed mode and just didn't really feel like doing anything but I mean you, everybody needs that time every once in a while. Like, a lot of people do it in the summer, like, you're just super rela- blah, blah. You're just super relaxed and you just don't feel like doing anything, and that's basically how I was for Christmas. And I really hope all of you guys had an amazing break and a great Christmas and got to spend time with your family, because family, you don't get to choose. You should always love everybody in your family, no matter what happens. You should just be thankful that you have family and that people are there for you and just don't don't take your family for granted I know I might sometimes and like everyone does at some point but just I truly I really try not to do that anymore because family's family and they'll always be there for you no matter what happens and I also had a really fun time just hanging out with all my friends just because I'm always away at school like during over half the year and so I never really get to see them I probably get to see them four months out of the year because that's summer and Christmas break and that's about it so I was just having a really good time catching up with everybody and just hanging out and just having a good time and so I am really sorry that I didn't make videos like I said I would would but if you like this video give it a thumbs up and tell me some of your resolutions down in the comments like something that you can truly achieve and stick to all year long but other than that no oh, also another resolution that I'm gonna try and do is I'm gonna try and get on a schedule with videos and try and post them probably every two weeks because that gives me more time to film a video and come up with ideas and edit it so if that doesn't happen I'm sorry but I'm going to try my best to make a new video every two weeks. So, I hope you s subscribe and stay along with me on this journey. And, yeah, that's basically it for this video. So, bye.